I know you guys haven't seen me do like artwork video in a while, but I this one's the easiest one. This one sparks from the Kirby series. All he does is, is a spark of electricity to harm Kirby. The simple design of semi aqua green, yellow, green yellow, and sparks come out of this antennas. Sparkly light blue. I'll tell you, it's like a raindrop of liquid character. Kirby can suck up his enemy by using uh, sparks of electricity. He by shocking his enemies up. In Kirby 64, he he said him. When there's like two of them all together, he uses up a huge globe of electricity and chunking them to death. Or many you use electricity as a bit of sparking wire for some reason. Turn, no, that's spark of electricity turns Kirby into a refrigerator, which makes sense. Spark of electricity. He will he own this explosion? Yeah, I don't know. That's how it works. First need bomb by turn to a on those spike enemies. And what else? Oh yeah, crossball arrow. That's kinda cool. Oh wait, that's... No, I'm right. It those abilities of electricity power is quite helpful. Even when Kirby uses his animal friends, they use electricity powers as well. In different ways possible. Sebri Sparks is a simple design enemy. Destroy Kirby. And when Kirby comes near it, it takes damage. So it still gets sucked in by Kirby's healing ability. By sucking it in and either spin him out or shocking powers. And I think that's it. That's all I can say about this character's design. That he's just like a simple raindrop. Of the trusty powers come out of his sides here and there. Been appearing in lots of Kirby games since the Adventures of Kirby's Adventures on the NES game. Quite useful powers since 1993. Did this every day, y'all. See you around.